morning. Welcome back to my channel. I'm Greta. I hope you're doing well. I hope February is treating you well. February is a shorter month. We gotta enjoy it because it's gonna be gone. It's gonna just disappear. So today's video is kind of weird. I actually wanted to do this video like seven, six months ago. And this was a time when I was like getting really into Friends because I had never watched the show Friends ever in my whole life. So I decided, you know what? I'm gonna watch it. I wanna see what the hype is about. And girl, I am dressing like Phoebe this whole week. So I wanted to chat with you how it went. Was it hard? Was it easy? Would I recommend it? <laughs> first things first, I needed to pick the outfits that I wanted to wear. It feels so weird with straight hair. What's up? How's it going? Today is Monday. Now, I don't have similar sense of style. I don't think many people do uh, as Phoebe. I have some pieces that uh, I know I can definitely incorporate into the outfits, but there's some like a couple pieces that I need to go out and find. So how am I doing this? I actually created, I'll put it on the screen. I created four different type of Phoebe vibes. So first we have girly Phoebe. Girly Phoebe, she's wearing like a cute floral dress, very summery, very light and airy. Outfit two is Comfy Phoebe. Comfy Phoebe, she's like super just like chill, relaxed. She's got like a skirt underneath a huge oversized sweater with a moose on it. Then we have Festive Phoebe. This is where she's wearing her Santa pants and she's wearing like um, the huge belt and a t-shirt. And then we have Monochrome Phoebe where she's kind of like playing along with the same color on her velvet dress and her like, um, what is that called? Like an unbuttoned collared shirt and some riding boots. And honestly, I was most scared of this one because I was like, girl, where am I gonna find Santa pants? Where am I gonna find pants like that? Um, but yeah, so those are the four outfits that I did. And the first thing I did was go thrifting. Since today is Monday, I thought that I would do Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. So I guess I'm kind of cheating because today's Monday. But I decided today would be the day where I go to the thrift store because I want to be a sustainable sister. I'm going to try to find a floral dress like the one that she's wearing in her girly Phoebe moment. For monochrome Phoebe, I wanted to find an unbuttoned collared shirt. I already have a velvet slip dress that's red. Um, it's not quite as long as the one that she's wearing though, so I might see if I can find one that's longer. Anyway, so we're gonna go. I'm gonna stop talking because I know how much I hate when I'm editing uh, and I have to cut out so much because I won't stop talking. Yes, Greta. It's super rainy and I have straight hair. Well, I don't know how this is gonna go, but let's go. Okay where we live we live a little bit outside of atlanta and the area i live in doesn't really have that many thrift stores so i was like okay my best bet is going to be goodwill because it was the closest thing to my house and so i went got in my car went and wow ow <laughs> hey. i have my 20 dollars mis 20 dollars y vámonos Sometimes when I go to the thrift store, I find so many good things. I find so many like cool hidden treasures. But I think when you're specifically looking for something, that's when you find nothing. So I'm currently looking for the floral dress and I can't find anything. <gasps> this is actually so much harder than I expected. I haven't been thrifting since I made my thrifting video, so. A sister is out of practice. <laughs> yeah, everything is either like not what I'm looking for or just like way too long. Ugh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Well, maybe this one? I feel like no. I don't know. Maybe I'll try it on. My contact flew out. Honestly, I had such high expectations. I was like, I'm gonna find the entire four outfits. I'm gonna find Phoebe in the, I'm gonna freaking find Phoebe herself in the thrift store. I was so optimistic and yeah, I shouldn't have been because I found one thing 
I found the floral dress um, but I'm actually really happy because the floral dress was the one thing that I knew for a fact that I did not have in my closet so this is the dress it actually guys it actually fits okay I mean obviously this top part girl does not fit but I thought it would be cute if I wore underneath it like a higher neck I have this um, this white shirt from and other stories that I literally wear under every single everything that I can wear under I think it's super flattering so I think I'll wear it under this dress and yeah it actually fits okay it's I really didn't think it was gonna fit me at all but yeah we can make it work we can make it work okay so I am back in my car and <sighs> that was kind of a flop <laughs> so good thing most of the things I do have and the main thing that I did go looking for I did find so that's not too bad you know that's not too bad so I found the dress like I showed you me trying it on this is the main thing I actually went for so I'm glad I at least found this because I have nothing that I could wear that matches that Phoebe outfit so I'm so happy that I found this and it was so cheap it was like six dollars so love it so that was Monday uh, that was basically all I did and I just made sure that I had all the outfits together and I planned them and because all I had found at the thrift store was a dress I needed to make sure that I at least had everything else for all the other outfits and I actually surprisingly did even the Santa pants I found something that made it work okay that look very similar to the Santa pants that she was wearing and so thank God okay so let's talk about day one let's talk about comfy Phoebe this was my favorite Phoebe this was super easy because honestly this whole outfit is something that I would completely 110% wear uh, just the whole I've been really into actually sweaters over skirts I think that's so cute some people think it looks like you kind of look like you have no shape to you, you kind of look like a grandma, you kind of look like a carpet, but I think it's fashion. outfit of this Phoebe week and I am pretty proud of myself I feel like I got this outfit pretty like you know pretty good I think maybe I would wear it. I feel a little bit like a little bit I would eat that a little bit grandma like you know just a little bit so I just made my coffee for the morning I am going to what am I doing today in this outfit just to give you an idea as to what Phoebe is doing today yeah so I'm preparing my portfolio my UX design portfolio if you're wondering and I'll catch you a little later so that day I actually didn't end up doing too much in the public eye to wear it in public but I did go meet Tony which is my boyfriend I went to meet him at this place which I highly recommend it's called Tea House Formosa it's in it's on Buford Highway in Atlanta if you're from Atlanta <laughs> yeah so I went to meet him there and we just had some tea we got some work done and his reaction was very what I expected it looks like what I would usually wear right man you're a female. I'm a Phoebe. You said I was a Phoebe and a Rachel. Okay, it's totally okay. <laughs> okay, so day two. This was the day that I got to be girly Phoebe. This was the day that I got to wear and sh like reap the benefits of my efforts at the thrift store and wear the thrifted dress.
wearing wearing this outfit today I how do I feel I feel kind of like a grandma a little bit I don't know why I was very optimistic about the dress when I was um, when I tried it on at the thrift store I thought it was like it could work it was a little big but I was like you know what I can totally make this work I can wear like a t-shirt underneath I can wear boots on like up like I can wear boots and it'll work out and I feel like I, it looked worse <laughs> when I tried it on again. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like I never wear my hair in a ponytail, like never. So I am so, I feel kind of exposed. I don't know. And that evening, a sister went to a Galentine's Day, um, was it, it wasn't really a dinner per se. Well, kind of dinner, but also like mainly drinks, you know. And we went to the garden room in Atlanta. Oh! We're on our way to get some drinks. What's at the garden? What's it's it called? called? The garden room. And I think the garden room. Yeah. I think it's next to the St. Regis Hotel. In oh. Booking. Wow. <laughs> but yeah, I'm wearing the Phoebe outfit. So proving cute. that I'm wearing it in public. I feel kind of self conscious. What do you think about this outfit? I think it's really cute. Really? But wait, isn't the Phoebe outfit with a sweater on top of a dress? No, that's a different outfit. Yeah. Ooh. So I made Phoebe's outfit wearable for a <laughs> night out. So we'll see if anyone comments. <laughs> oh, it was beautiful. It was literally a garden in a room. And I went with some of my Latina sisters and had ourselves an evening. Okay, so day three was monochrome Phoebe. And okay, so it wasn't really end up being monochrome. For me because I didn't find a flannel that's another thing that I was looking for at the thrift store actually was a flannel that matched the color of the velvety dress that I already had in my closet so the dress that I had was kind of like a crushed velvet um, red dress I could not find a red freaking flannel I flannel <laughs> probably the darkest part of this video was me realizing that like Oh my gosh, I have failed. I don't know what to do. I just tried to make it work as much as I could and then I wore all the jewelry, I wore the boots and day of work and yeah I filmed a video that day oh girl I was actually really um, productive that day but that day I just ended up going to the gym with my mom and she had something to say about the outfit it's 8 09 and we're finally going to the gym I am you can't see but I'm still wearing the Phoebe outfit but mom what do you think about my outfit what do you think about this outfit Wearing a, did you I see it? I think it's very chic. Really? Mm -hmm. Especially because you're wearing my boots, so they're perfect. <laughs> yeah, I'm wearing her boots. They're not my boots. Where are they from? Do you know? Nordstrom. Nordstrom? Oh, they're so comfortable. to like I, my goal was not to just wear the outfits while I'm at home I wanted to wear them like more in public and then for it to be a real challenge but you know it didn't really work out that day okay so last day my favorite day festive Phoebe girl day four was the day it was the day it was Valentine's Day was I, you know, okay, so this was a Santa outfit. Um, so this was festive Phoebe. 
And I, at first I went to the thrift store thinking, okay, maybe I can find like some red pants at least. And so instead of going for the color of red, I started thinking like, okay, let me think of the style of the pant. The pant is kind of like wide-legged, it's a little high-waisted. I realized, I was like, oh my God, wait, I have some pants that look so similar to these Santa pants, but they're just a different color, they're blue. But this whole outfit came together like really well. Valentine's Day I didn't want to go too crazy because I mean we were gonna take photos um, because Tony and I went to dinner which was Cheers. <laughs> what do you think of this Phoebe outfit? I like the sweater. The sweater is very Phoebe and the graphic tee show spunk. You know which outfit this is? Uh, which episode? What? Do you know what episode? Well, you, you gestured to your stomach, so is it the pregnancy episode? It's where she's wearing Santa pants. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those she's are wearing Santa pants and a graffiti in the Okay, but okay. But she cuffs them, so you see the heavy cuffs. I don't wear Santa pants, but look at it. Oh, is that corduroy? Yeah, like here's where it's curry too, fuzzy. Yeah, fuzzy. Okay. I made it through. I got through all four days of the challenge. I am so proud of myself. I honestly didn't think I was going to make it or I thought maybe like I might give up halfway because I'll feel like it's too complicated or I won't find the outfits, but we did it. You can do whatever you set your mind to, but it was cool to try out, like to just dress up as someone else for an entire week. It kind of got me out of my comfort zone and made me realize, you know what? Fashion honestly has no boundaries. You do what you want, express yourself. Phoebe always expressed herself. She can be like a testament and inspiration to us all in the fashion community. I hope that you enjoyed following along with me this entire week and I'll talk to you in my next video. Besos, bye.